I'm going to show you how to light a Bunsen burner. The first thing you need to do is check that there's no damage on the rubber hose. If there's any sign of wear or tear or little holes or perishing, let your teacher know now. First thing you do after making sure the hose is intact is plug it into the gas tap. Then you need to make sure the air hole is closed. Next step is to light a match and then either you or your lab partner can turn on the gas. Make sure you shake the match out. Don't blow it because you might accidentally blow the Bunsen out. This is the yellow safety flame. As you can see it's highly visible. It's also slightly cooler so it is safer to be around. When you're ready to heat, you slowly turn this part of the Bunsen is called the collar until the air hole is open. Don't be scared, none of this part of the Bunsen is hot. As you can see this flame is a lot harder to see. It's also very hot so you need to be careful. When it's time to turn the Bunsen off, don't blow it out. Don't blow the flame out because then you might accidentally leave it on, the gas on, and dangerous gas would start to build up in the room. In order to turn the Bunsen off, all you do is simply turn it off at the gas tap.